Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. The Tasks folder in Outlook helps you organize and manage your workload. It tracks tasks you must complete and reminds you when they are due. You can also use tasks to assign work to colleagues. This chapter shows you how to use this feature to assign tasks to others and yourself and manage your daily workload. To open the Tasks folder in Outlook, click the Tasks icon in the navigation bar. Alternatively, click the Folders icon within the navigation bar, and then click the Tasks folder that appears within the folder pane. By default, Outlook shows tasks in the Tasks folder using the To-Do List view. In this view, tasks appear in a list within a pane by due date. Alternatively, if using the Simple List view, tasks appear in a traditional list that you can check off as you complete them. Overdue tasks appear in red, and completed tasks appear with a strike through. Each task has a checkbox to its left you can click to check after completing the task. This does not delete the task from the list, but simply strikes it out so you can tell it is completed. To change the view of the Tasks folder in Outlook, click the More arrow button in the lower right corner of the Current View button group on the Home tab of the ribbon when viewing the Tasks folder. Then click the name of the preset or custom view to apply from the list that appears. The Detailed, Simple List, To-Do List, Prioritized, Active, Completed, Today, Next 7 Days, Overdue, Assigned, and Server Tasks Views are the names of the available preset views in Outlook for the Tasks folder. To delete a task from a list in Outlook, select the task by clicking it. Then press the Delete key on your keyboard to remove it and send it to the Deleted Items folder. Alternatively, click the Delete button in the Delete button group on the Home tab of the ribbon to delete the selected task. To view the details of a task in your Tasks folder, double-click the task to open the Task window. To close the Task window after viewing the task's details, click the X button in the upper right corner of the Task window. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.